guys, you're listening to Buffer Buddies. I'm your shopping boy, stock boy, Jared uh, from Up and Up Die. I'm Tiffany. I pick up the apples that fall on the floor. Uh, this is episode uh, 97 of Buffer Buddies. We're watching Chopping Mall. If you guys don't know what this is, Buffer Buddies is a movie night podcast. It's not a movie podcast. It's a movie night podcast. It's a podcast of people watching movies at night. Not the movies. We don't talk about them. Well, we do talk about the movies, but we don't talk about the movies. It's a very complicated premise. You're just in for a ride. Stick around. We're going to have a good time. Uh, we're watching. Is there anyone else in listening? Nope. No one in the audience. No one in the audience. <laughs> no Empty cares. theater. Empty no theater. No one should... wants chopping block. Dude, I was the most excited for this movie. And to see like no one show up for this movie, I think they're missing out. This is actually like, I think if you look it up, it actually has a high rating because it's like a like, a highly rated B movie. So I think they're making a huge mistake. So are there bees in this movie? Yes, there's many bee bees. Movie. Well, I mean, chopping mall. It actually is a, it's a mistake. It was meant to be stinging mall, but it doesn't have a good, there's no pun there. It's like, what is that? What is a stinging mall? But so shopping mall became the pun of chopping mall, but because the bees chop at you in a chopping motion. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. I, there's no other explanation for it. Um, yeah, but I think how did this made did this movie? And that's what gave me the idea for it. But I was like, look, I'm like, oh, man, it might be actually be too good. Um, but I came up with some skip ideas for this one. If you're ready okay. to hear them, I'm ready to hear them. Okay, so I do know a little about this movie. Um, I believe I don't know. I never seen anything. But what I understand of the movie is uh, it's mall employees get locked into the mall after hours. And then like there's a security system or something like that. And it's like automated AI robots. So they're locked in and the AI robots turn on. And then like, well, all humans who are here are now uh, like uh, intruders, I think. And so it's them killing them. And it's like really bad. I guess everyone dies or something like that. So is it my, like a, sorry, sorry. Go yes, on. No, no, you know, you go ahead. What did you, you'll already stop this train full <laughs> stop. You might as well get on. <laughs> is this like some sort of like allegory of like, what's it called when like stop till you drop? No, like when you're sick and then the, the things Fever. they fight, they fight you. Oh, antibodies. They think it's you. Yeah, a little bit. I, in a way, that may not be what it was intentional, but it's kind of like that. Like, it's like, oh, you're, yeah, it's like your body attacks itself. There's a disease specifically for that if it's like attacking itself. Uh, yeah, it's kind of like that in a way. These are like the antibodies or whatever for the thing, but it's like, oh, I'll just kill whatever's around. Um, so my skip idea is, so knowing the premise that of, this is my understanding, it takes entirely place inside of, of a, of a, chopping chopping mall <laughs> um if you could believe uh and there's a uh, it, robots and there's humans and the robots kill the humans so my my skip idea is um all robots we skip any scene with humans and we just we just watch robots go around and then i, I think occasionally kill somebody i don't know so it just be this security system going crazy for no reason malfunctioning no humans around and then my other one was no robots where we skip any time there's a robot in scene and we just watch the movie of like teenagers who are like scared and they're just running through a mall and then they die sometimes. <laughs> I don't know how that will work. Um, those are my skipped ideas. I think uh, I like the second one. No robots. No robots. Okay, so we're doing like this un Michael Bay version, some kind of yeah, like D as what, much like D Transformer. <laughs> like I don't. It was it was a movie that's like robot centric, and then we could like what is the opposite of that? What, uh, uh, iRobot. iRobot. And Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Okay. So we're the Fresh Prince version. <laughs> it's such a long <laughs> cognitive the jump fresh, to get there. The Fresh Prince. Well, because Will Smith fresh, was in iRobot. Yeah, I know. But if you're like, we f did the Fresh Prince version. <laughs> I don't think anyone's going to get Prince. that off the top. Because if you tell someone we did the like, Michael Bay version, like, oh, well, you had an explosion. It's like, yeah, we only did the explosion. I don't know. <laughs> so I don't think anyone's going to get that. But we could definitely... I'm going to hit play so we can get to this. It's only an hour and 16 minutes long, but I'm excited to see how short this movie is when you take out all the robots. Because I'm hoping there's a pretty good amount of robots. Yeah, I... Wow, surprisingly, is, is that a robot? Loud. Is it still like uh, crazy loud for you? I really... Uh, not super loud. Okay, I think it's fine. I'll adjust as needed. Um, but I, I really like robots, so... But I thought 
people running in a mall scared for no reason is really funny too. So. Well, my, my theory That's too though funny. is um, robot. Only, robot. Oh yeah. Is it a robot or a toy? It's That's a robot. a robot. Yeah, it's just right. showing us no robot. So this guy tried to uh, burglarize, yeah. and then he died. <laughs> he yeah. tried to break into a mall, and then he died. He fell down. <laughs> uh, honestly, that's a much more economical security system is just slippery carpets. <laughs> like they're passive. They don't require ma- like much maintenance. They're not like moving parts. No bullets to reload. Uh, do I skip stationary robots? I don't know. Like they're not doing anything. But do we not? But do they we are robots? Are we are we robot deniers though? Are like I think no we robots? Are robot deniers. Okay, so even like these stationary ones are like yeah. Okay, I don't believe. Yeah. I don't. Well, what was that? I want to go back to that. What did I see? I think there's too many robots now. We've what have we done? Okay, well there are we're outside a building. Okay, so oh my gosh, get out of here. Okay, chopping mall. Oh man, this is like such like an '80s movie. I think it's '89. I think this movie was X-ray. Help me. Oh, X-ray uh, pauses pause the movie. movie I don't like that. <laughs> I just wanted to roll. Let me absorb all the information. I feel like there should be like a setting. Yeah. Do not ever pause the movie. I, I want to be like, I'm. Wow, look at this guy just sweeping the floor. <laughs> this is a weird mall. It doesn't seem real. Um. I just want to move on a mode where like Amazon never stop playing and then always show me x-ray. I'm just absorbing move information right now. I'm trying to yeah. become the most movie. Like the IMDB experience. Movies are wild, man. Why is it sped up for? What are the hell is this? Did they squish his ice cream into his face? I don't understand. Yeah. So elevator opened up, showed a kid with like a like triple scoop ice cream. Then a sped up version of a bunch of people getting in the elevator and then sped up people, those same people getting out and the ice cream, the ice cream is missing. And that kid's shirt was pure white, became like pure brown. So he didn't even eat the ice cream. It just went all over his shirt. This is awful. <laughs> I already hate this movie more than anything. Oh man, I really wish he spilled all the sodas. This, Spill oh, no. <laughs> oh, it's so unsatisfying. It's such a tease. It's such a tease. Oh, man, this kid is strangling this man. Yeah, he almost like kind of strangled that, that old man. Oh, not no. sh- I'm not sure if that's his this- dad or like... What is happening? I hate this so much. This is a bunch of things that I don't want. Why is he skateboarding? <laughs> I can't do Shopping this. mall culture. I can't do this. He's want- like slalomly. Slalomling? Yeah. What is that word? Sol- slalom, I think. What is this? <laughs> oh, I wish I had, a, you is, had your eye is, tracker. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is literal chaos. And it's. I hate it because it's close to like. This is, it's like, if it, oh my, she spilled the drinks finally, thank gosh. But she didn't, she didn't get bumped into, she was yeah, just, she just, she just threw spilled it on it, them. I'm just glad that they're spilled. That was a funny but bit, But this is though. like if Aliens made a movie. They're like, humans you know what, go to a shopping mall and they buy boxes of stuff and look at overconsumption of soda leads to spillage. I hate it. Um... You know, I think yeah, I feel oh, like this, this is guy like just a- burned his mouth on a, a pizza that he's halfway done with. <laughs> How do you get there? How do you get to halfway and then burn your mouth? And why is that guy's shirt? I have so many things to note on. Why is everyone's shirt so dirty? They all got went into the elevator. Look at that guy. It's like he's he sh- went to the elevator. It's like he went he, all over his It's like he shirt. laid down and was like, "Could I be any more snake?" <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man, they're just dropping. I feel like this is like a commercial, like just a really long commercial yeah. for shopping malls. Or like a really long infomercial. Like, is this you? At the end of the movie, at the end of an hour, the guy's going to be like, is this you? And you're like, what? The whole movie. Is this you? You should buy our rag. Our, 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 our like, you clean Tag up yourself. Oh Tag yourself. Tag yourself. I'm the kid skateboarding through the mall. I don't want to be anyone in this mall. <laughs> I'm the guy in the escalator who fell down because he was looking at the models going down. That's 100% you. I agree. 100%. <laughs> Unconcentrated or concentrated. I don't like this movie. That, made, that whole intro made me super uncomfortable. But the thing's built. You should be happy. Yeah, but everything else was super weird. It was so weird. So- it was so... I don't like it because it was close to... Um, it was close to like humans, but then it was so far wrong. I never experienced anyone like that. <laughs> I have a question. Yeah. Can lightning strike a robot and change its programming? 
Probably not unlikely. I think that's what's going to happen in this movie. Yeah, is it the same? Isn't it the same plot of like what is it like Short Circuit or something like that? I've never heard of it. Okay, they need to stop showing these robots because I got to keep skipping it. So lightning is striking this. Oh, robot yeah, I think again. Short Short Circuit. Whoa, what is? Is it is it okay? This guy just died looking at a, a naughty picture yeah. of a lady. We That's didn't see happened. a robot though, so this guy just died. He just died because he looked at the lady picture. That could happen. Yeah, abstinence. This might be um, one of those like yeah Christian like propaganda movies, <laughs> which would be pretty great. Like I I hope everyone does something like wrong before they die. It's like gluttony sloth like i hope everyone is like one of the seven sins that'd be great <laughs> he trusts me to take care of the store while he's gone uh, at the whole store oh the no i'm thinking store. of the whole mall oh yeah I, was like, he's, Big. I would love it if there was a guy like billy watch the mall for me <laughs> what <laughs> yeah I I, i'll just be bathroom. right back you got this and it's like the entire mall he's just running back and forth trying to make sure everyone's happy you guys good you guys good you guys good Oh no. I don't have streamer mode on. I don't like this dialogue either. This is boring. This has become Everyone, super boring. It was very weird crazy. to very mundane. I don't I don't understand how like this is this is just a guy with hair, but he looks like he's from the eighties. Yeah, and I, don't I, know I was how like, to I don't it. <laughs> it's the hairstyle. I don't know. Yeah. But people have that hairstyle. Radagast has that hairstyle. Yeah. <laughs> I know Radagast kind of looks like he's from the eighties. I guess if he had those maybe? big glasses like that, eighties man. Yeah. Well, yeah, like that guy, he looks like he's from the eighties because of the big glasses. This yeah. guy looks like he's from the eighties because he has a mullet. But the guy in the middle, he just looks like a normal guy. And yet he still looks like he's from the eighties. I don't get it. You know what would be interesting? If I had more like if I had like infinite money and like all the time in the world, I I it would be a, I'm sure there's an art form and a challenge to like shooting a movie but having it look just like it's from the eighties, you know? Like, yeah. like I want to like I, if I open up Photoshop or you open up Photoshop, and you put in a photo of us and I said, make people think this photo come came from like 1970. Like, I don't I, that would be hard. Sepia, sepia. Yeah, That's all it, I know. Did it just go quiet? It stopped. Oh, it stopped. Oh, OK. Cass is having problems again. Um yeah, yeah, it would be it like, but it's like, it's like, it's like, okay, let's see, you did it, you're like, set me a filter, and you upload it to Reddit, and people are like, this, you're, this is BS, I could totally tell that it is fake, and you're like, okay, went back to the drawing board, you added some, like, like, distressing, you know, it's like, what would, what would it take to make a, a believable, like, counterfeit photo like that? That would be hard, it's hard, I think it would be hard, so that I would love to, like, yeah, I'm gonna make a movie, and then, because the first, first thing I would do is go and get a movie camera, that they, they shot like they used in the 80s. So film and whatever. And now I'll go shoot a movie on it. But it'd be like obvious. Like, well, that guy's wearing like Nikes and that came out last year. So this is definitely not old. You know, it's like it might have the film grain and the feeling to it. But like all the tech around it would be like high tech, you know. So I'd be like, what what do you have to do to replicate an 80s style movie today? And I think that'd be kind of interesting. I think the only tech that you need to replicate like back in the day movies is like a time machine. Oh, yeah, you're right. Why buy a bunch of machines? You can only buy one. That's always the cheaper option. Yeah, it's easier, too. Totally. My cast is broken. Hold on, let me try to yeah, fix Yeah, it's this. still frozen. No, yeah, it's I, it was, I just left, and it wouldn't let me join back in. Um, Should I leave, and then maybe you can? No, I don't think it's that? you. I think it's this is dumb. Uh, stalling for time, stalling for time. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, now uh, it's acting super weird. Cast is weird. I hate this thing more. Than I, you know what? Yeah. I hate it. I used to make fun of Rabbit. Who knew this could this could only get worse? <laughs> this is so I mean, much, oh boy. Worst case, can we Discord since it's just the two of us? Uh, yeah, I guess that might be a potential possibility. Um, let me do. Let me try one more thing. Uh, so oh wow, I have a oh that's why it's not working. Maybe this should work. So, yeah, yeah, like, that's always, that's like, yeah, I was like, what if you made a really old movie? Um, 
Or like, I think who does it pretty good is like Tim and Eric on their show. Like they make it look bad on purpose. I was like, mm-hmm. it's hard. It's actually kind of hard to do that. Like, unless they're like, like they do that thing where like they're in front of a green screen, they zoom in and it's like flying around the screen. Like that's an <laughs> annoying effect to do if you're doing that digitally. But if you're zooming in and actually moving a real camera around, it's a lot more easy. It's like a lot easier to make that look natural because it's real. But like mm. if you're doing that post production, it's actually hard to make those zooms and those yeah. pans look like realistic or like believable. So it's like sometimes like the easiest way is obviously to, to go and replicate the entire scenario, like a scientific project. But it's like, what if those things don't exist? Or what if you like, I want to shoot the thing in 4K, but I have it come out, look like an old thing. So you have like a red camera and it's like super high quality. And you're like, I got to make it look all stupid, like an old movie. But like, I still want it to maintain 4K. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a movie guy, but I think that'd be interesting to see like a movie in the theaters. That's all like believably old. And then you know, people are like, I can't tell. tell in the thing is that well let me join the room <laughs> let me try leaving oh I left the party I want to leave the room yeah you're not supposed to leave the party oh the, man the, the posse I guess I didn't have to go home but I <laughs> also went home and <laughs> left that party you don't have to um, go home but you're, you're, I'm going I, yeah I don't have to go home but I'm, that's where I'm going to go <laughs> Oh my gosh, it just says connecting doesn't do anything. Like, what do you want me to do? That's what it was happening to me uh, when I was like, uh, let me in. Oh, wait, maybe, hold on. Yeah, maybe I close. Well, I'm close cast and then reopen it. Yeah, let me, yeah, let me do that for both my computers. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, one, two, three, banana. Oh. One, Two, three, ship. Pineapple. All right. One, two, three, SpongeBob. Island. <laughs> One, two, three, Bikini Bottom. Bikini Bottom. Whoa. Nailed it. Done. It's so easy. <laughs> this game's so stupid. <laughs> I, we can't. It's useless. <laughs> it does can you imagine, nothing can for you, us. Can you imagine if, if uh, in Pacific Rim, when you're looking for your drift partner or whatever, they played that game? Oh my <laughs> gosh, that would be so smart. You're just re- you're walking around. And, dude, what if they just put a bunch of people in a room and then you just start yelling out words until you hear someone else say the same one and you're like, you're the one. You're like, yeah, all right, let's yeah. go fight monsters. That'd be kind of cool. I want to go back to the improv class and then I want us to like, okay, this is is what we have to do. We have to go back to take improv classes, but then we don't say that we know each other. Okay. Uh, (laughs) And then uh, one day we'll play that and look, me, 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 you, me. Okay. One, two, three, skateboard. Okay. We're done. We did it. First try. Crazy. Right. Insane. (laughs) And they're like, what? But it ends up being like a full phrase. Yeah, and then yeah. I take off I take off the mask that I'm wearing and I'm actually you. And oh then you gosh. take off the mask that you're and wearing and you're actually you. me. Yes, that would oh. be brilliant. <laughs> Blow their minds. They're like, I just happened to put on this mask of this girl I don't know. And you happened to put on your mask of the boy. What? How did that happen? Where'd you get that mask of anyways? That's creepy. <laughs> Why do we each have this? Given to you by your father and his father and his father? Alien Are, conspiracy. Do we have the same dad? Are yeah. we related? Is this parent trap? <laughs> The Wait. Illuminati. Yeah. Tra- yeah. <laughs> yeah. Parent trap. You know, yeah, the Illuminati, yeah. the parent trap conspiracy. That was my favorite part in that Lindsay Lohan version of the parent trap was when she fought the Illuminati with her butler. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was pretty crazy. That was like it felt really out of place for the movie at the time. But looking back at it now that I've grown and I'm a man, I totally get what was going on in that part. Yeah, as a as me too, as an adult man, <laughs> I can watch rewatch that movie and uh, and relate to this like ten year old girl. These two ten year old girls who. The movie did full Illuminati. stop and then like yeah then the movie got real dark and there was like it actually got like r-rated it was the only movie in history to like the the rating is like pg rpg because that middle part is r-rated yeah and but but you know how like there's those those high-pitched sounds that only like young kids can hear yeah but but there's like the r-rated part that only adults could watch so oh, yeah, everyone's yeah. sitting in the same theater but it for was, some reason it was like hype based <laughs> So if you're below a certain height, you oh, saw no, a different movie. Yeah, yeah, you still. Well, I mean, if that was I in the theater, saw. yeah. If you if if you went to the theater nowadays, you'd still see the kid version. You have to get a booster seat, 
And it was just <laughs> odd because you're kind of a booster seat and they're like, oh, got to say ID, which is backwards and of, of it, how it should work. <laughs> I can't get back in. Can anyone else get back in? Uh, I haven't tried. I was waiting for you. Mine's just doing connecting, connecting, connecting for like ever. Uh, My group. Watch. It doesn't work. Let's just move it to Discord. If I think possible. we should just do Discord. I think I could do that somehow. Um, Screen share? Yeah, I gotta like do a three way call. This is oh, really behind the curtain for you guys. <laughs> can we can we clap and like cut this out, or do you want? I'm just gonna leave it in. I just, what the oh, hell? Okay. This is on yeah. like the part of the spirit of this podcast is that it's unedited. Also, I like the <laughs> like the challenge of like something went wrong. Turn that into entertainment. You know, it's like also nothing, we're lazy. I'm, I'm also we're lazy, but also I want to be like unstoppable. Is that thing I was saying where it's like, um, I want someone to be like, can you do a a 30 minute spot and like dude i do three hours twice a week 30 minutes i could do that in my sleep and then i go on stage and i sleep and they're like this is art what, this is mind-blowing how do these how is he doing this and then you become the next shia labeouf okay let's move to discord i can't do it yeah anyway. yeah, yeah um hold on i'm trying to think of how this is supposed to work because i need to uh, i killed a fly because i thought i wasn't gonna hit it because i thought i was gonna fly away okay Okay, I do need to. I do need to do a quick cut. Okay, and we're back. Okay, so we had to. Uh, My turn. Our screen share software that we're using to watch a movie together just totally like broke down for like what was that like twenty minutes? It felt like. Yeah, we just had to to freaking rethink our business plan. Yeah, <laughs> the whole podcast relies on start this, a new life. Yeah, other other technology company that just totally abandoned us in the middle of nowhere. That's oh, okay. man. Is a car a robot? <laughs> uh, I'm going to say no. I'm going to say it's, that. It's not so automated, right? Yeah. It doesn't have like, it All doesn't right. have like a computer brain, you know, technically, yeah, there's an ECU, but I'm not going to count that. That's more of a control mechanism than it is like decision making process. Um, what about like a Tesla? Mm, Teslas are getting closer. I think that's a, a yeah, uh, yeah. Fully automated. Yeah. If you're doing self-driving. Yeah. That's a robot. Sure. I can't hear anything. Can you hear it? I covered this whole deal when oh, I said a little bit. What is going on? Of course, I remember. I mean, um, if if cars are frogs, mm hmm, cars are frogs. Got it. Tesla is a frog. Okay. And everything else is like a tadpole. Is furniture still oh, right? Cars tadpole. are frogs. Tesla is a what? We have Tad tadpole. Tadpole. What's the word? What's tadpole. the baby frog? Tadpole. tadpole. Yeah, I'm just trying to like parse it. Okay, if cars are frogs, Tesla <laughs> is a tadpole? No, no, no. Tesla would be the frog. Oh, Tesla's already a frog. Yeah, and all other cars are but like But what tadpoles. happens when cars get smarter then? They become frogs. Oh, I mean, no, but what if Teslas get smarter? Wait, okay, hold on. Now I'm confused about tadpoles. Level. Yeah, what do you think a tadpole? Wait, what's the issue? What What is a tadpole? That's a baby frog? Baby frog. Baby frog. Do, 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 yeah, do. Yeah. But what's the... Is there... Are they actually... Because you know... Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, Jared, Jared, Jared. Uh, help yeah, me out here. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know how butterflies... In the sky... Yeah, Stop. they can go twice as high. high. But they uh, don't want to. They're humble and don't want to brag. <laughs> Butterflies are nice creatures. <laughs> Why is any, anyone in this chat um, suffering with me? Um, <laughs> no, okay. So so caterpillars, uh, metamorphosis, they more, met, right? That's into yeah, a they, butterfly, right? They, yeah, they could but go that's twice not as what high. Happened. That's not what's happening to tadpoles, right? No, they they grab a tail and they absorb the tail and then they their legs pop out. Frog. Yeah. yeah, they go and goes and they go. But why? And, and their arms pop out. But why? But why? Yeah, that's what they say. They're like, but why? They're like to their they're like but like but <laughs> why? And then as their tail goes away. So this isn't better than Discord. <laughs> it's not, but I do want to get through this movie. Yeah. There are a lot of, like, topless ladies in this movie. That's what makes it so good. Yeah, it wouldn't sure. be an 80s movie if it wasn't for that. Robots. Robots. Topless robots. <laughs> 
what? <laughs> That's what I'm here for. Men want one thing and it's disgusting and it's like topless robots. <laughs> Just like robot, like, you know, like think Terminator with Arnold Schwarzenegger, no top off. And I mean, like where you can see the exoskeleton, the, the, like the metal. Like without a top, like without the human flesh top. That's what I'm talking about. I want to see those servos. Look. Susie, are you listening? What are we gonna do? What if? <laughs> what if? <laughs> but like, isn't the problem like? That's right. Oh, robots! They look too human. Yeah. Or whatever. Or androids, I guess, look human because that's the definition of an android. Yes, correct. What if they made them human, but they actually just made them see through, so you can see all the inner bits, just so you don't, you know. So you don't get confused. Yeah. Why not? Let's, so uh, let's human, celebrate our differences. Yeah, you know. So, so they're like all full on human, except for the skin is like see through. Yeah, and you can see like the inside bits. Got it. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. I'm down with that. That seems yeah. awesome. Because yeah, oh, okay, wait, can they be like kind of purple? <laughs> it's like the '90s, like N64 controller. I was thinking blue, but yes, that basically like the Game Boy. Yeah, the, the Game, Boy, Game Boy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The the stock sl- standard Game Boy. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, wasn't there, wasn't there a guy killed in this room just like a second ago? Wasn't this the guy that was killed in the room just a second ago? No, that was at the beginning of the movie. Oh, did the robots, the robots. clean it up? Oh, I guess. I mean, I don't know what a robot is. That's a robot. Okay, so the guy I ate mean, a donut. Oh, I see what you mean. And he's on a he's on no, he's, he's on, on the a phone. phone. Is a phone a robot? <laughs> no, <laughs> it's definitely not. <laughs> it's uh. not skip all technology. <laughs> But I want to. <laughs> a robot. I mean, yeah. a, a thing. The trick is not skipping too much. I like the idea of like, not skipping for stationary robots. So, yeah, this guy's like, this plat, like, again, assuming that, and we know that these are not sentient or moving at all. So, this guy's like, just keeps looking at this, like, toy. And that's it. <laughs> Damn, not enough skipping. <laughs> Okay. Is a radio a robot? This is this is a philosophical <laughs> podcast yeah. now. You yeah. know, is is a radio a robot? We're asking the hard questions here. You won't get this from those like those podcasts who are scared, who are scared to ask questions like uh yeah. Um, uh, dang, I can't land this joke because I don't remember the guy's name. Controversial topics only. Like uh uh. Howard Stern, he shies away from these questions. I'm going to edit that down so it's really smooth and really funny. Oh. I'll do that. So it's like, wow, Jared's sharp. He's really on top of the things. Yeah, he re- he really knows who Howard Topical. Stern is. Topical. Topical. Hilarious. In- in- inside of. Good shot. Nice Good one. <laughs> Good shot. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Perfect. I recommend three wood. <laughs> You're doing amazing. Come on, you guys, give me a break. It's not a lot of bookkeeping to catch up. Where get away? Yeah, tonight you are going to shake that ultra Wally image of yours one and four. I don't know what they're saying. I feel like the people in the 80s are just speaking an entirely different language. This is basically like, yeah, right? I understand this just as much as I understand Shakespeare, if not less. Yeah. It's like, gee, Willikers, cat. cat you're you're cooler than a cat on cat. a hot tin roof. <laughs> there you go. Boy. Get that cat off that hot tin w- roof. Dude, you're yeah. crazy up there. I can't think of funny 80 mo- sound words because I don't know them. Because if I knew them, I would understand what they were just said. Oh, boy. This audio is really crazy, Pants. It is. Is she a robot? Let's sh- say she's a robot. <laughs> <laughs> Specifically, one person just out them as the robot. Is an exit sign a robot? What would be great is oh. if if uh, let's just not even acknowledge them anymore. Okay, there's a lot. Okay, of all right. Yeah, I like this no robot part. Oh my gosh, these little thumbnails lie to me. No officer. Okay, there you go. So so oh, what what I've noticed so far is that like it's a mall. Some lady spilled something this guy looked at a magazine and died um yeah. this other guy tried to break into the mall and died and then now there's these people 
kissing. Oh, there's two different people kissing. Or are they the same people? I don't know. I can't tell. That's they all look the same people. thing. Yeah, okay. well, these people spend a lot of their time at the mall just because they work there. It's a little crazy. It's a little weird. Yeah, I wouldn't. Yeah, I'd go home where it's comfortable and not a mall. I'm scared that the no robot version is boring. Yeah, maybe we should just do the robot version. Can we switch midway? I don't like switching midway, but this is also. Oh, wow. <laughs> this, there's so much happening right now. <laughs> this movie's stupid. <laughs> this is a stupid movie. I just don't understand. Is it to show that she's not a robot? That's how that's how the only way you know. You have to take off. <laughs> Prove that you're not a robot. Look it. I'm, I have flesh. I don't believe you. Take off all your clothes. Become, become a frog. Now you're a <laughs> Tesla. Congratulations. They're like watching TV and stuff. Like, why wouldn't you just go home? Like, they only have like snacks. They don't have like food. Wait, is this the mall store? This is the, this is the store. This is the why? store that those guys work in. Uh Oh, is it because he has to watch the mall and the guy who told him to watch the mall never came back? No, I think it. Yeah, that's right. He's like, watch the mall. And he's like, I'm going to take it up for a joyride. <laughs> yeah. What if the mall is a Transformers? I just the mall it. is a Transformers. Yeah. Like, what if it's like, like the oh, mortal no. engines, but the mall is like oh, actual oh. big old car? No, the, the mall is a Transformers, Tiffany. Who taught you grammar? The mall is a transform. Is a transformers? Yeah. Is is, is the is noun plural? Transformers is is, the, is noun. the entity. Yeah. It's it's all. I all am the John Benjamin H. I am a transformers. Don't be scared. <laughs> Uh, 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 Optimus Prime, Bumblebee, Jazz, all of them, Jazz Kitchen, all of them. There's one thing. So the Transformers. Is there Hell's Kitchen? What? <laughs> yeah, Hell's Kitchen is my favorite Transformers. <laughs> From the planet Ramses Gordon of the Gordon Galaxy. Yes. Oh boy, I like humans how, are boring. I like how they're also watching a real crap movie. I'm sure that was their equivalent of this movie. It's what very, if we started a new a new thing? What if we only watch movies where they're watching movies? Oh, and then we only watch those movies. Yeah, like The Simpsons has that uh one that one movie with uh McBain, and someone like edited it together. And it's like eight minutes long uh, throughout like the whole they're all Simpsons they show like 30 second clips of this movie it's like a movie within a movie and um and like uh, uh like edit it all together it's actually pretty long and I was like it's actually really good it's actually really cool uh, oh boy why was that guy like mopping with mud why are they in a mall when it's closed yeah why are they like having a beer like go finish your job and go home Jared, Jared, i have a new skip idea <laughs> what every time you see a mall <laughs> just like <laughs> credits i'll be out of to see i want to i want to do oh man if i again if i had more time if i had all the time in the world i would love to do these art projects where mm -hmm. it's just like shopping mall but only parts where they say mall so it's like mall 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 <laughs> and then credits <laughs> Man, I wish there was like time. He's making it worse. He's putting dirty mud on the ground. How is that efficient use of your mopping skills? Well, anyways, he finished his job and that was real great. Anything you'd rather have? Oh, wow. The humans aren't I think he'll pick up. I think the humans will start doing more interesting stuff. Okay, I don't know what's happening, but she just dumped her whole entire purse out on the bed. Maybe she's looking for stuff so she can continue to do the thing that she's currently doing, but safely. But now it's all messy. It's like there's like a tissue there and like wrappers. Maybe that's how she and, likes it. Maybe it's like ambiance. Yeah. Maybe she's like, I can only do this with you if it looks like we are inside of my purse. Yeah, I, I, it's the thing I have. <laughs> I've always wanted to pretend that I was at the bottom of my bag. Man, this is man. The eighties were weird. You always get your way, don't you? What did robots are happening? Robots are not happening. Sure. 
are they still in a mall? Is this what's, what's happening? They're in the mall. Yeah, the whole movie takes place in a mall, Tiffany. But we went why? over this. But why? I don't understand. It's, it's a shopping mall. But, like, why would you do that at the mall? Isn't that... Why, 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 They're why, all why? Hunt homeless. What the that's, hell is... There's so much. There's so much. Lot. Yeah, there's a lot. The 80s are so weird. The wild times. People you didn't know, know how to make movies at all. To be fair, I mean, not even fair, because this isn't going to be fair at all. Um, those were weird looking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to comment. I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, <laughs> I don't think the 80s were real. After this movie, I don't think the 80s it was, were real. We just skipped from the 70s to the 90s, and then we made movies about the 80s and told everyone they existed. Yeah, it's a conspiracy. The Earth is flat, and the 80s were real. Fake. The 80s were fake. Fake. Yes. It was the... Um, um, I thought what? he was peeing on the vending machine. That's how you get free stuff. Uh, uh, what is it? The not the McClurk effect. Uh, the one where you forget things. The not the mezzanine. Um, to me, you know Mandela. The, Mandela. It's like the Mandela effect, but you don't even know. What oh, if the Mandela effect is a Mandela effect? Is a vending machine a robot? Is the vending machine Mandela effect? <laughs> is a vending machine Nelson Mandela? <laughs> But dude, he's been smiling and looking for like 30 minutes. Okay, finally he did something interesting. Oh boy, this this movie is I slow going. For an uh, for an hour and 60 minute movie, they wasted like 30 minutes. I feel like I could have done this. this the first movie that ever existed in the entire world and they yeah. didn't know what they were doing. I could have done this movie oh, I could have done this movie in like 10 seconds. I like how the guy answered the phone and then died. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the phone killed him. <laughs> this was an Did anti-phone they... movie. Hold on. Question. So there are different people in different areas of the mall. Do they all know that each other are there? Or do they think that they're the only ones in, alone in the mall? Does that make sense? Yeah. I think they kind of think they're the only ones in the mall. So there's like five groups of people who think they're the only ones yeah. in this mall. Yeah, they're, they're probably going to meet up and team up. But here's my thing. I'm so fascinated with this, like, sub society where, like, all these mall shops are like, oh, what's up? Like, like these, like, people, like, living in their stores. So after the hours, like, we think the mall's closed and everyone goes home. But there's, like, one person for each store that still stays there. And they all, like, come out at night and just, like, walk around. Like, oh, it's pretty nice out here. What do you got? What do you got doing over there? I'm watching a movie tonight. Um, like, it'd be so interesting to see, like. People just walk here, like treating the mall like their home. Bye. That is so weird. I think that'd be pretty funny to see. I w- like the mall's <laughs> technically like the mall is like technically twenty four seven because like people stay out stay there all night and like like oh I want some food I guess I'll go down to like uh, uh, Pan Express and the Pan Express guys there and I'm like hey can I trade you like they, it's all trade economy based too but like <laughs> it's not open to normal people it's just like open for the people in the in, in over there. So they're just roommates. Yeah, yeah, in a big, big like it's an apartment building almost. All right, none of that, none of that. All right, blood, jelly. They got jelly on the glass. Oh no, all that jelly. Oh, he just irrationally. Now, now they, see, look at they're just running and irrationally flipping stuff, and a chandelier falls. You, you know, like if if. The, the funny thing about this movie is like, okay, let's write these different like couples at the small. These two people are doing this. These two yeah. people are doing this. These two people are doing the same thing the first two people are doing. Yeah. <laughs> no variety. The phone's dead. The computer must have taken control. How did he come to that conclusion that the phone is dead and therefore the computer must have taken control? The phone could, that individual phone could be broken. It could be the line. It could be, there's so many branching paths where the the point could have been a failure before it gets to the computer. So what you're telling me is the phone is a robot? No, the, the computer controls the phone and that's the issue. All right, now they, they're just so scared that they, so the first they started running, they, they screamed. They saw. They probably saw like a shadow, and they flipped the table over. They ran to the back room, and then now they climbed into the vents. 
they're being very irrational for, for, I mean, uh, for a mall without robots at night. What a crazy thing to do. Yeah, I guess like if you're in a mall by yourself, then why not crawl through the vents? <laughs> I guess so. It's every person's dream to reenact Die Hard. <laughs> That's probably the funniest thing you've ever said. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I've said funnier things. <laughs> I think maybe just in reference or in comparison to this movie. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Within like, oh, the funniest thing I ever said, and then it's like instance like today. Is it like roll over? <laughs> like yeah, if, I have a, a yeah. goldfish brain. So. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, oh, I guess yeah. So it's interesting today at work. Uh, we're interviewed. Uh, well, not I didn't, but like people at my work interviewed this girl. But like she worked, I worked with her at my last job. It was kind of funny. Um, uh, did you do the? Whoa! What are you doing here? Whoa! What are you doing here? Well, oh, I'm a little bit. So I saw I, I saw her like walk in and because we we're like eating and then like we we're eating in the lobby room the lo and I saw her like walk and I thought I I, I was like oh, I think I know her. I tried to kind of wait, but she didn't see me. But that was also like maybe it's not her. And then so by the time I got to the office, she was already talking to one of the other guys and I don't want to like interrupt. So I just like, I was like, Oh, I'll say something like when they're done talking. But then she was like, then she was like, Jared. And I was like, Oh, Hey, yeah. And she's like, what did you know it was me? I'm like, yeah, I just didn't want to interrupt. Cause I was like, I don't know how to handle that situation. I, I thought it was weird. Um, I guess also not saying anything is also a weird response to that. To seeing someone that, you know, um, I don't know what to do in those. That's a, I don't have, I don't have the, 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 the playbook for that situation on hand. Um, and I thought that was funny. And then, uh, the two people like they they all like the people who interviewed her like went off they're like they're like oh let's go talk about it and then they came back and then my coworker was like uh dang it, what happened it was like so he's like what, what what like what do you guys think and she's like yeah you're fired to the guy and it was like the and I was like that's the funniest thing you ever said and I thought it was pretty great like she like the guy was fired so they could hire the girl <laughs> it's a joke it was wow. funny at the time you kind of have to be there you kind of have to work first you have to get a four-year degree in computer science work at a different company then get hired at my company and then and then be there and then it would be funny you know what's funny <laughs> yeah i've made i i've i've done a partial of yeah, those you, you each almost, and every one of those things you almost got the joke you seem you came so close to yeah that joke. yeah i was like i'm like yeah gotta go. i'm like you know like when when people are like oh i'm you know, I'm I'm half ethnic, part, part I Irish, or, you know, yeah, or like I'm bi biracial. I'm I'm you know whatever. And then there's wow, like people who are like racist. a quarter <laughs> <laughs> bisexually racist, um, Bi uh, bisexual, bisected, bi racist. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, like uh, you know, like I'm a fourth Irish. I'm a, whatever. Yeah. I'm like a sixteenth computer scientist. <laughs> yeah. So close. <laughs> I was like, you should do a boot camp. I wonder if that would work for you. I feel like that would be beneficial. I think you would like that. I think now that I'm older and my mind is more mature, you could handle. Oh, man, I did the quote wrong. I was supposed to quote the song and I didn't. Oh, but anyways, right. my mind is older. And but I, I think maybe but I also could, you'd yeah, skip all further. the BS like science yeah. stuff. That yeah, probably like bogs the, you down. You just get, yeah, get to like, the coding and just learn good coding patterns. Yeah, all the all the stuff that's just like well, sit in your chair with your back straight and yeah. your butt parallel to the ground. Now put your arms down and put your fingers on the this And is everybody the clap your hands. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yep. <laughs> She's yelling, they're running, they're yelling, they're shooting guns off in the mall. The guy's on fire. Some and now, it, you know, the thing that I do like about this movie is yeah. that they do look like they're killing each other. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I knew it. Like, it was a slow start, but if you skip, if you, if you, oh gosh, I, I gotta re edit this movie. I might do a recut of this movie where I actually cut out every single frame of a robot. Mm. I might have to do this. Spend a spend a Sunday or something like that. But, but can you overlay music so it's actually like the the Emmy? What is it? The the Emmy award winning version? Oh, but I, like, I'm actually saying like upload like a 20, 30 minute version of this movie. Oh, I see. Are like, you gonna Are you gonna Are you gonna keep the naughty? Part? No, because I'll probably like upload it to YouTube or something like that. So I have to cut that out too. 
Wow, he just did great parkour for a mattress salesman. <laughs> They're just blowing up an elevator for no reason now. <laughs> Why is that their plan? I like how they're... So they're trying to kill this dude, right? And he was on top of the elevator and he jumped off. Clearly, like, 10 seconds before them. And they're still shooting at the elevator after he jumped off. And they missed him completely. He was in completely out in the open. They could just shoot him right now. Shoot him. Are they are they friends? Even friends? Or are they, like... Comp- is this, like, a battle royale situation? Oh, where it's just like, oh. that's the whole thing. They, <laughs> yeah. they like gluttony like binge like they ate and they did it and they're all like like drinking and now it's like now we fight to the death like it's like a like one last celebration before they battle royale kill the, each other yeah i want to see like a PUBG fortnite version of this movie oh my gosh but in a mall pause but like real talk how come there hasn't been a of uh like a, a battle royale movie that seems wait. like a real big missed opportunity wait 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 jared yeah Wait, can you, can you, <laughs> are you, can you, can you elaborate? A Battle Royale movie? Like specifically a Fortnite or I mean, a PUBG movie or? I mean, like that would be the smart licensing move to make. Cause like, I, there, I can't tell if this is a bit. What are you talking about? I can't tell if this are is a bit. Are you thinking Hunger Games? No. Hunger Games. That's not the same. <laughs> No, there's Battle Royale and Battle Royale 2. Oh, those are dumb. That doesn't count. <laughs> Just because it's named but, that. No, but they're, they're, they are what Battle Royales are. Are they? Are they? Let me yeah. see. Yeah. Do you ever watch them? No, I don't think so. It's a bunch of students. They go on an island and they have to kill each other. One must survive. Oh, I can't even search Battle Royale. I don't know why I thought that would work. <laughs> it came with like <laughs> a million YouTube videos. You don't have to watch the second one. The second one was not the best. Is this like a Japanese movie? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've never. I don't think I've ever seen this. Yeah, but it's literally where I think that's how the the term came to be. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Never mind, Dad. (laughs) Okay, but still, okay, but still, there isn't one that's main for the mainstream American audience that you could just cash out. Yeah, yeah. That's why I was just like, oh, like a PUBG slash Fortnite or whatever. That's what I'm saying. That would be the thing to do is like go contact. uh, go yeah, contact them and be like, hey, uh, we want to make a thing with your licensing or whatever. But like, um, but yeah, it could be like whatever. I, I'm just thinking more strict to the rules though. Even if it's not branded, like a hundred people all drop in and like kill each other, like straight up, like that specifically. I don't know if that's yeah. what Battle Royale is, but like it's a it's a little bit like that. It's the oh, okay. the principal. The principal for some reason sends all his kids to the island to kill every or and then they only one survivor, and then some of them just go crazy and kill themselves. They kill their friends, you know. Blah blah blah. blah. Um, the, I think the only thing that's different is that there's no like. You know how like there's that circle that closes in on yeah, you. Yeah. There's none of that. Mm. Um. So that would be interesting. Yeah. So to add that element into it, and then yeah. like um, uh, what was I say? I don't even remember. But in yeah. In the second battle royale, that's not very good. There was like a concept of like duos. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like where because they each had a collar, and if you were too far from your partner or if your partner died then your collar okay. would explode now add that into fortnite and PUBG. Just trade ideas here because that's actually kind of a cool concept for, for yeah because you know how we used to play a little bit of like PUBG or whatever and we get that random and they just go off yeah i would like it if they died because i <laughs> i hated when they did that i feel like th- but we would all die oh that guy just fell down he just fell. Just I think falling. it should be the person that's. Oh, he just fell off. That's wait, wait, the wait, dangers wait. of the mall. Hold on, hold on. So there's there's three couples in this movie. Yeah. And I feel like ten people died already. How many yeah. people are in this mall? I don't know how many how they just keep dying. But also, I, I love this version of this, this edit of this movie because they're just running and shooting. <laughs> they're like nothing is there, guys. What are you afraid of? <laughs> and these shots too are so perfect. They just keep showing nothing. They, they're um, just trying to escape the mall now. Yeah, there's like shoot, shoot, shoot. Um, I forgot what I was saying. What we're we talking about PUBG movies. Um, no, I, what it should be is the the person that's like two that furthest out. So you have like a ring around your party, and it's weighted based on like okay. So as long as like you're all within 
10 yards of, of like three other people, you're good. And so that one person will only die if they exit like some ring. Mm-hmm. Go anywhere they want. So, you, so you, you have a ring on the map that you could see and that moves around based on your party. And so like you could accidentally or you'd be great, too, though, is like, you know, what happened. It'll be absolutely hilarious is three yeah. people start moving on and they're not they don't realize the other person didn't go with them because we have do, we do that all the time. And that one person just blows up and dies. Just oh, like, no. but I was, oh, guys, look at I found an 8x scope and they just blow up. And you're like, what happened? Oh, we left. We didn't realize that you're, you know, it'd also be great if that happened to kids when they were children. And their, mo- their mom oh, wanders no. off and the kid's just like, mom? <laughs> That's right. Well, she, she went to go get the milk. Yeah, she went, go, the she, she, go, she went to go get the milk. The kid blew up. <laughs> Give you something really to worry about. Oh man, there's just so much, so much. Uh, I, I uh, knew this would pick up the robot. No robot cut would definitely pick up towards the yeah. end. But now it was a rough 30 minutes to get through, though. So much boobs to endure. Too much. Can't even. Can't even appreciate Wait. it when there's that much. <laughs> I couldn't hear. What did you say? <laughs> Too much boobs in the beginning. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Can't even appreciate it. <laughs> oh, if it's it's like you're giving it away for free. Yeah, right? it's like, like it's just tease like a, it a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Um okay, here's my legitimate video game idea. All right, hire okay. me Square Enix. Um a I'm final- gonna send them this podcast <laughs> unedited episode. <laughs> yeah, where we talk about boobs. Um They're like, what is this? They're like they're like, what's what is this? What is this? Why did she send us this? What, 30 minutes later? I guess. <laughs> um, uh. um, okay. So. Uh, so, okay. So in Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles, the game that you are absolutely going to get for Christmas, I'm really okay. telling you. Okay. Um, <laughs> so we can play together. Sure, sure. Um, there's a there's a mechanic where you play um, if you play single player, then you get a little Moogle buddy who carries around this chalice with you and you have to fill up the chalice uh, with water, basically. And then that creates a ring, a protective ring around you. If you play with multiplayer, you don't get the Moogle buddy. And then so someone has to carry the chalice. So usually when you're playing with like a group of four and you're little, you, the person that you <laughs> like the least <laughs> carries the chalice. <laughs> um, anyways. OK, so imagine that. But Battle Royale, Final Fantasy, but your group has to stay within your chalice circle. This is like a legitimate idea. Okay, yeah. So basically what you're saying, but using the mechanics that already exist in my favorite franchise ever, Hire Me Square Enix. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I would love to see Battle Royales that aren't like FPS based, like top down RPGs or something like that. Yeah. Look at see, her, she's just scared of she's, these people have gone out of their mind. She just attacked the closet of stuff. Gosh, this yeah. is great. This is good. Edit. This is good edit. Man, maybe next week we do a follow up episode where it's only robots. Maybe we just do the same movie. What if you? This gives what us if you, two podcasts per movie. Okay, wait, Jared. Yeah. Let me give you this That's idea. Once you edit down the movie, let's watch that movie on both of <sighs> That might be a good idea. Because it, it will be better because I will not allow a single frame of those robots. You know, like here, okay, going behind the curtain a little bit, of audience, we are pretending that we're not seeing these mo- these robots, that I'm skipping over them. But I'm thinking, like, there isn't wait. one. Yeah? Wait, we're, we're pretending? Well, okay, back back into the podcast. What are you talking about? We're not pretending about anything. There's well, no I robots in this movie. Yeah, there's no. I haven't seen any robots in this yeah. movie. I've been waiting for this movie. You told me that there's robots in it, but I haven't seen any robots. I lied to you. I knew you liked robots, and it was the only way to get you to watch the boob movie. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is all for I me. need to type down some notes here. <laughs> <laughs> That'll get some clicks. <laughs> <laughs> or ban off of iTunes or something. You think so? You what think if I so? spelt it wrong? I don't know. The, let's see what you got. We'll what figure it I out use, at the I end. Could, I could use zeros. I could use zeros. Might get us through the the, the filters. Those 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 damn filters always trying to stop us. <laughs> <laughs> through a gun. <laughs> he, he I threw always a gun loved, and missed her. I would. Yeah. I always fire extinguisher. 
misses her. Oh, she threw it back. I always love it when someone throws a gun. It's the well, funniest. I mean, what else are you gonna do it's if you just, can't? If but, you know, but it's just like the thing that is meant to kill is now being a bl- like a like a like a like a primitive thrown object. It, 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 the action of throwing a gun is such a, a display of desperation that it is always funny to me, no matter what. That is pretty funny. I do like it in movies when oh, look at dogs. Where's dimples? Oh, waiting for us. Um, so, <laughs> so I do like it when, um, uh, like in movies when people are, are shot in a non-threatening situation. They're shot in a non-threatening situation. Okay. Yeah, like accidentally shot, but it's like funny and not not serious or scary. Oh, okay. Um, and they go, "You shot me!" Like yeah. <laughs> that yeah. always makes me laugh. That's always a good one too. I'm always just like, it's also, yeah, you don't, you almost never see this, but I also think it's funny when someone like gets a gun and then just, they decide to throw it before they even shoot any rounds. <laughs> That's always funny but, too. You know how there's that complaint where it's just like people in movies who don't know how to shoot a gun magically learn how to shoot a gun. Yeah. What if there's that person who just literally went, I don't know how to shoot this gun, so I'm just going to throw yeah, it. Yeah, I have a better chance of hurting you by throwing it than I do than by trying to shoot it. Yeah. Honestly, actually, so. it's probably true. They probably have a higher chance of hurting themselves with that gun than so they might as well just throw it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I would do. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Look at her. She's falling. She's falling. Man, these people do not understand mall safety at all. There's a reason Here. that the mall is closed at night. I feel like. No um, lifeguards on duty. No. Li- well. I see. <laughs> How is she? What? What? Did a robot come out and save her? She fell three stories onto one of those like pop up tents you see at the beach, and she's like fine. <laughs> like she just got like is just got up. <laughs> well, I mean, she's Does, crawling, but like is she crawling because she's hurt? I think or is she, crawling she broke because her she's leg. Trying or not to get noticed by the other mall attendants. Attendees. I don't understand that though. There's no way. If she paints herself, With then the no blood, one can find yeah. her. They'll they'll think she's part of the thing. Man, these people are just breaking windows like nothing. Those are thick panes of glass. You'd be all cut up. Also, how come none of these 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 businesses have the security pull down? The all malls have that. What security pull? Like the the, the security like grading. Like the the laser grid? Is that what you're talking about? Yes, the laser grid that chops you if you try to go through it. Yeah, that's why it's called the chopping mall. Oh. Chopping mall by day, chopping mall at night. Oh, I just got that. Yeah, I yeah. I just got that, that it's shopping mall. I've been calling <laughs> this movie chopping mall. I've been saying it wrong? It's chopping mall? It's chopping mall. It's chopping mall. I thought it was shopping mall. It's chopping mall. Oh, so I, I am right. It is chopping mall. <laughs> It's chopping mall. <laughs> is it? Sh- it's shopping mall. Chopping mall. Chopping mall. It, no, what? This movie is called Stingy Mall. <laughs> <laughs> what mall? Stinging mall. Oh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> the, the it's so hard back. to. Oh my! What is? It? I'm trying to hold on. I'm just so intrigued by what's like, happening there, on there's screen. There's just robots from here on out. So I feel it's like it's really you hard skip to skip, to skip it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I just understand the point of a robot going into paint. <laughs> like, what is that supposed to do? <laughs> Anyways, um, what was I saying? I'm losing my place so much in this movie. There's just so much going on. You're being distracted. Yeah. Um, oh, uh, oh, the, the metal, the metal, like roll up security door. That's what I was solid telling you about. Oh, I see. You know those like. <laughs> Yeah, and then, and then they pull it. They pull it almost all the way down. It's like three fourths down. It's at like shin height, and then you're like, and you you lean under it, even though it's porous. You lean under and stick your head under, and you're like, "Are you guys closed?" <laughs> and then you know, <laughs> <laughs> even though you can talk right through it, you lean down and tuck under it, and you go, "You guys closed?" <laughs> 
Because <laughs> sometimes they're not. <laughs> it, and if they say no, you got to do like a cool Indiana Jones roll underneath it. Oh yeah, do you do you? Uh, is that is that the goal? If you were an employee, yeah, you got to do a little. You got to do like a little roll as it, it's closing. Just gotta. So, are they the only two survivors because they did not do the nasty? They did the battle. The That's right. I, oh, dude, I called it. I'm a genius. But also, battle royale. They won. They yeah. killed all the other ones. <laughs> I love how like happy they are and not totally in shock from killing all their friends. I know, but maybe they they like, were the ones who wait. But according to this movie, they were the ones that killed their friends. But still, I mean, I guess if that's what you wanted, I guess if that's what you set out to do, you're like, I'm, you're happy you won. But it definitely yeah. feels like, um, like, look at her. She's a robot now. Yeah, she's a robot now. She is. She spun around. How humans can't do that unless they're robots. But it it so seems like in these movies, like the survivors, like, oh, I can't believe it. We did it. But I'd be like immediately. That's not the first thought I'd have. I'm like, I'm alive and everyone else is dead. I'm going to need at least three days to get over my friend's death. <laughs> oh, so boy, three days is- maximum. That's, that's <laughs> being generous. I'm so glad that these are credits. <laughs> I've never. I have my rating though. I have a my I have rating. A rating? I'm, okay. I'm very excited to. Well, I'm going to gonna pause it because the audio is all bad. But yeah, yeah, do your closing. Do your closing. So, by the way, guys, before we we're, so just letting you guys know, we're going to rate the movie. Uh, now that we finished this edit of it, we're going to rate it based on how we think it works as a group watching experience as a movie night for you. So if you guys are listening to this, you guys can kind of use our rating as a as a rough guide to um, uh, like like uh, like like doing this yourself with your friends, maybe at your house or maybe also using some other online service where you can watch movies together or whatever. Um, but before that, just want to remind you guys again. Uh, thank you so much for listening. You're awesome. I love that we have people who listen to this. See, it's a paradox. I could say that if no one listens to this, no one heard it. But if people are listening to it, then I'm thanking them. <laughs> wow, you sure showed them. Yeah, it works great because I could just I could just say whatever I want. I'd be like, wow, we have a million people listening. It's like, what are they going to do? Either we have a million people listening or it's a joke. So, <laughs> uh, um, uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, but uh, if you want to find out more information, go to uh, That I always try to keep that up to date with like what movies we're watching next and stuff like that. Um, but you can also just find us on any podcast app. Please tell your friends. It really does help us out. But also maybe check out like our other stuff that we do. Me and Tiffany, uh, we stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash up down off die. And we're also on Instagram and like Twitter and stuff like that. And we, I think we produce some pretty funny content. Uh, we have a YouTube channel where we upload like um, some edited videos and some like good snippets from our Twitch streams. So um, like we do like this other skit that we do live and then we take that and upload that as a highlight. So go check those out on our YouTube channel. Just search up down thigh or just go to our website or whatever. Um, I think that would be really cool of you and we appreciate it. Also join our discord if you want to connect with us. And if you're in SoCal, we also run some meetup groups with Twitch. And if you're just generally gamer, you should guys check that out. Um, yeah. So we can rate this movie. Are you ready? Um, I had a rating and I forgot it. So that well, was I'm going to, I'm going to do mine first so you can kind of think okay. about it. I give this movie a zero out of 10 robots because there weren't any in this movie. <laughs> That's a harsh rating. That's the harshest rating you've ever given a movie. I don't think you've ever given out a zero before. I've given out. This is my would be my third zero. What? Uh, How do you know that? Because I don't give them out to any movie. Um, wow. Any movie. It was, also, three. it was also a joke because zero robots. Yeah. Uh huh. OK. But now that's like going to the database I'll build someday. There's going to be some Wikipedia that someone's going to set up and your ratings are going to be all over the place. Screwing with the data. Well, now they know which movies to definitely avoid. So these are legitimate. <laughs> yeah, I legit give this movie a zero out of ten. Oh, you really didn't enjoy it. I didn't enjoy it, it as, the, as a movie, the, as a movie with friends, as a anything, as what? anything in the background. Was it? Was it because of the weird boobs? You thought they were weird. They, they they didn't look <laughs> very like, you know, not to shame her or anything like that, but. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, like mid the '80s, you know. Yeah, um, I'm gonna give this like an like an eight out of ten. Um, Whoa, eight out of ten uh, friends uh, kill friends. Eight, eight out of ten friend kills friend kill. I like that. Eight out of ten friend kills. I thought it was hilarious. 
especially this edit. I think this edit you is just, very you funny. Just, you just like the part. I did. I, I did like, like I, I I like the weird poops. <laughs> <laughs> that was my favorite part. Um, no, I just think it's I just like I I think it's probably a on its own a probably a funny movie or like a crazy movie where people are dying. But I just love the scene of them running and looking backwards and shooting nothing. Like to me is like the, it's what I imagined and I got exactly that crazy thing. Also, I love that I paused the screen on this John Turkleski guy and he's just smiling at us for the last twenty minutes. I hate this. Yeah, he's just like this. yeah, this movie. Yeah, this, this is my this is my face. <laughs> Uh, he doesn't actually look happy. He looks like he's gritting, gritting his teeth and bearing through it. Um, so that's pretty much it for this podcast, right? Yeah, I think so. All right. Don't don't go live in. Oh, don't go at malls at night. Avoid the night society. They don't like outsiders. Have a good one.